Yeah, so this is where I had my first fight. It wasn't amateur, it was my first white collar fight when I was about 12. I lost my first fight. I had a rematch with the same kiddie and I made him cry in the second fight and I had stopped him. Now I'm back here again, um, 14 years later, having my first professional fight. So, first time for everything, isn't it? Come then. I don't know what it is, but I don't feel nervous. Normally I, I am, but I don't know. I'm ready to go now, so that was stage two. First one was a weigh in, stage two, eating. Stage three is to get some sugar from the shop and then find our changing room. To do the music as well. Yes, so what's your ring music gonna be? Johnny Cash, the lumberjack. No. How could I not? I don't think the people here will understand that, but yeah. they'll understand when they announce my name as the lumberjack and then I'll just literally chop them down from the ring. Then and then they're, they're oh, okay, I understand now. When you stand on the side of the ropes and shout timber. Timber! timber. All good, ready to go. Fit and ready. So this is Mo, Mo Prime, my manager. He's going to make me a millionaire. And you're, you're going to make me a billionaire. Yeah. <laughs> and he won't be on these, these little shows long. He'll be on the big shows. Well, he said it himself. He said it himself. Not long, and I'll be on the big shows. So, um, yeah, obviously easy, got to prove myself. It's easy getting you on, honestly. Yeah. Like, on, especially what's the man, if you've got something in Brighton, why wouldn't they have you? But, yeah. but we're going to do a show in Brighton just to showcase you. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, So you're, you're yeah. under pressure yeah, now. Get me right. and that's it. Yeah. Well, that's some good news. Obviously, got to walk before I can run, but I mean, he obviously thinks I'm a decent lad, so it's going to push me uh, on the big shows. What are songs that you're after, mate? So it's Johnny Cash, yeah. uh, Lumberjack. This is from the beginning. Yeah, okay. Yeah, no, this is it. Worked in that, yeah, this is it. So just Adam, sing it! Right, so this is, this is the chorus here. I think You go down, or you find yourself in any sort of trouble, I will give you every opportunity for you to show me right. that you're physically and mentally capable of carrying on. Yeah. Okay? Well, if I think you're not, in any way, shape, or form, I'll stop. Okay, I'm sure. Yeah, any questions? Yeah. Ah, okay, good luck. See you next time. Thanks, you. Thanks. Ladies and gentlemen, now 
it's time for our next bout of the evening scheduled for three minute rounds in the super middleweight division. And now, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome his opponent to the ring, Liam Forrest. He's opponent across the ring fighting out of the blue corner. He's wearing the white, black, and green trim. His official weight of 165.5 pounds. Tonight, he's making his professional debut, hailing from Sussex, England, United Kingdom. Introducing Leon! Forest. Step back immediately. Get your punches up. Obey my command to protect yourselves at all times. Good luck, lads. Good luck. Oh, 
him, but they're landing. Lovely uppercut, Lovely Liam. Uppercut. Would have left up with it and he's gone. Scorecard. Referee Mark Bates scores the bout 40 to 35. And your winner, Liam Forrest. Clear cut victory, great debut. What do you think there, Danny Matt? Yeah, I really enjoyed that one. It's like I said, I think this is possibly one of my favourite fights I've seen on Black Box. Um, I'm going to be following Liam's career. You know, that's the style of boxing I love. Debut. How did you find that? Um, to be fair, I shocked myself actually because through my whole amateur career, it's sort of like a tip tappy sort of um, sort of style, I guess. Uh, so I'm used to just getting in, getting out, fast, sharp stuff. But now I'm being taught to sink my feet into the canvas a bit more and let go of my shots. Also, I've got 10 ounce gloves, so that makes a massive difference. Yeah, roll on to the next fight. Um, I need to get the chance to just elevate in this sport. Every boxer here knows how hard it is to sell tickets. I got let down two weeks ago on the show. Um, out of my control, out of the promoter's control. Big respect to Mo Pryor. I hope he can push me on to getting on bigger shows and give me that chance because we all work hard, but I work extremely hard. I I've, I've, haven't trained this hard in my whole life. Like. Um, my coaches have pushed me to a whole new level where you feel like giving up, but I'd rather give up in training than not give up in the ring. So I do have a message to my supporters. I know I let you down the first time, it was out, out of my control, but you still came to support me two weeks later. I know everyone's got a book off work and stuff like that, but please keep supporting me and follow the journey because it's only going to get better and I can't do it without you guys. So thank you, thank you. Thanks everyone for coming. The Lumberjack! <laughs> well, Liam, that was a very, very exciting debut, and we can't just, we can't wait to see more of you in the ring. Thank you so much. Fucking too right. Let's go. Great post-fight interview there from Liam Forrest. Great support you can see in attendance for him, the lumberjack, and he made his guy timber twice with knockdowns in the first and the third round. Definitely want to look forward to, so definitely stay tuned. Oh, yeah. I it, mate. Get Whack out on YouTube. You get all of that, yeah? Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, baby. Great. But the you done in the end you had those walks in there. The lumberjack. The lumberjack. Officially established as the lumberjack because. As an amateur, I'm not going to call myself a fight aim, but now people are going to see why they call me the Lumberjack because I'm chopping these punches. Wow, the power you possess in those hands is incredible. And mate, you're going to be big. You're going to be big. Yeah. Anyway, just get me on TV. I don't care how. Happy birthday to Adam Martin. Get him in here. Get him in here. Go off the mark. I felt like my hands were hurting in that fight a little bit. He's got a hard head. Does that look bruised to you? It's like black. Yeah, that's, 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 that's how hard his head is. The lumberjack the is coming. 100%. Coming. It's here now, baby. It's here now, baby. We're making it happen. Everything that I worked so hard for is now happening. Pro to pro. Follow my YouTube channel. Shout out Terry Godham. He's putting the time into these videos. We're gonna, we're gonna go go, baby, on YouTube. Yeah, episode four. I said 
I'm not, uh, I'm not making 100 millions of pounds. I made a fiver on my first baby and I'm going to frame that fiver. But you're going to see me at the top making 100 of a million. Let's go. Let's go. Eat that. Oh, God damn. Right, let's go.